subscribe to the Danny Houston podcast, man. Man, so okay. When you uh talk about when you when you meet Screw, you know what I'm saying? Like how you even get turned on to Screw? Because this is around this time, right? Right, 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 right. You got moving a little bit. You know, tough blow, keep get moved off the scene. You know what I'm saying? You know that kind of, you know that kind of throw you. You know what I'm saying? That was my go to. You know what I mean? Hmm. So now I got to reset things. You know what I'm saying? I got to reset things. Look at it, cause cause you got to really think about it, DH. You got to trust somebody who you go scold from. You know what I'm saying? You got to trust them. Especially like that when you talking about yeah, getting that man, type of guy. Knock yeah. your head off. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So. So you got you got to trust him. You got to be real about it. You got to be ready. You got to you know what I'm saying. You got to come ready. You know what I'm saying because you don't know what's gonna happen. You know what I mean. That's just how I thought in it. You know. So I had to find another connect. You know what I'm saying. And, and how long did it take you to do that? It took a little bit, a little bit messing around. I end up, I end up getting the, getting my heaviest connect. End up coming like I say UGK. My heaviest connect end up coming through my baby mama. Hmm. People, you know what I'm saying. Her brothers was heavy, and 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 they had a they had a they had a Colombian type connect. Hmm. You know what I'm saying. So I don't need you. I just need your people. You know what I mean. And and it, and my and my baby mama connect me. You know what I'm saying. So that that helped me get out the streets. Far as you know, having to come find you. Or, mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, I had time where I didn't scold people like you, you know, just till I found myself, you know what I'm saying? You know, and, and you know, when I found that connect, you know, it was pretty good. But, uh, but like I say, keep going, man. So by the time I meet Screw, it's probably like 91. Uh, that, that came, that came by way through, through Quincy, through Q-Dog. Q Dog told Blunt and Pat, Pat told and me and Hawk, you know what I'm saying? And from there, you know, I listened to the music and, you know, I was feeling the slowdown. I was feeling, you know, way scratch and, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And, you know, as time went on, I, I found out, you know, his meaning. Once he got to know you, his, his scratching had a little meaning. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like if it was a part of you that he know, he might hit that about three, four times. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? You know, he, so you you start really feeling that man. So I was feeling the scratch. I was feeling his uh, his his way that he done things, his music, how he slowed it down, and then you most definitely was feeling how he talked on it. You know what I'm saying? So I went and over at that this man. time because this it ain't really nobody else on the tapes. It's just him. He's just shouting out the hood. It's just him. Just, ain't nobody on it. Yeah. I, I haven't. I hadn't heard nobody on the tapes. Yeah. Tape I heard through Patton and was just screw. And probably, bro, probably my first five, six, seven, maybe I I even go ten hmm. tapes was just screw. Hmm. You know, fool, you know what I'm saying? It was it was just screw. You know what I'm saying? Before you, you know, like I say, when I met him, he was at his daddy, you wasn't really going to his daddy's going off on that time about you finna be doing no rapping and going yeah. on, you know, so when you when you meet him, what's your impression of him? Like, all right, this the guy I've been hearing his tapes. All right, now I'm meeting him. Right, I go meet him. You know, I find out the process. So you know, you write your list down. You know what what songs you want on now. Who you know some of the people you want shouted out. You know what I'm saying? And take him a list. You know, you get to meet him or whatever. You know, and, and he came across you know as a as a mellow, good dude with a good vibe, like yourself, bro. I mean, I ain't just saying. I'm just I'm just being real with you. You know what I'm saying? That's how you come across, you know what I'm saying? So, so when he came across like that, so boom, I left, you know, and he would page you or call you when you're tape ready. When he called me, I happened to be at the store getting some tennis shoes, you know what I'm saying? It was some street ball Adidas that just came out black and blue. I'm getting some tennis shoes. So when he called me, I said, I was, say, bro, what, what size tennis shoe you wear? And he told me, you know what I'm saying? And I ain't say nothing, you know, I said, oh, okay. So I'm getting shoes. I grab him a pal. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I go pick up my tape. Walking. Do you remember the name of your first tape? Or I sure it? don't, bro. Hmm. I don't remember. So I, 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 I go in there, uh, pick my tape up. I had a foot locker bag. I say, hey, bro, these for you. Hmm. He say, huh? I say, yeah, man. Some new Adidas just come out. Boy, I grab that box. 
the box on the table, took that shoe out and put that shoe on top of that box. But old man was walking through the kitchen, grabbed, that, grabbed his old man by the arm, and they had a moment, man. That boy said, see, I told you this going to go somewhere. Mm. That boy, him and his old man connect. And I just kind of stepped out the way. I know it's a moment. I let them have their little moment. You know, from now I get my tape, boom. And from now, dude, man, man, screw, man, our relationship grew and grew and grew and grew and grew. And, man, you know, just one of them, you know, things uh, 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 how I see life. You know what I'm saying? What I see when you bring value, when you when, when you bring something to the culture, you got something I like that I want that also I want you to understand that, you know what I'm saying, what you're doing is good. You know what I'm saying? Don't let the lifestyle of, of the culture and what I'm doing pull you over here. What you doing, yeah. remain a DJ. Mm. So from there, man, I, I just started investing in the boy. Buy my, he ain't had nothing to do with his money. He had his own money. You know what I'm saying? He ain't need me to do it. Every time a pair of Jordans came out, man, probably for the next three, four years, man, I bought that boy. When I got a pair of Jordans, he got a pair of Jordans. Mm. Every time, bro. I call him, hey, I got them... I got them. I got them brown ones for you. I, you know what I'm saying. I got them southern stuff for you. Every time, Space Jam, Black. It it, it didn't matter. Whatever came out when the, when Jordan came out, screw got him, man. That's real, man. So Donnie Houston. Donnie Houston. Donnie Houston. Donnie Houston. Donnie Houston.